वेलकम अगेन टू माई चैनल ऑर्गेनिक एंड हाइड्रोपोनिक अर्बन ग्रो ग्रो फ्रेंड्स टूडे इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट ग्रोइंग वाटरमेलन इन टू हाइड्रोपोनिक सिस्टम फ्रेंड्स वी कैन ग्रो वाटरमेलन इन टू मेनी ऑफ द हाइड्रोपोनिक सिस्टम एंड वी हैव डिसाइडेड टू ग्रो वाटरमेलन दिस ईयर इन टू थ्री ऑफ आवर हाइड्रोपोनिक सिस्टम ऑफ विच फर्स्ट इज दिस मीडिया वेज ग्रो बेड हियर वी हैव यूज द मीडिया एज अ कोको पेड second we are going to grow it into the the bucket which you can see behind those are media buckets where the media is clay balls and third on the back side we have dwc bucket and where the media is water we are going to grow same variety of watermelon all over the place and see which is growing how now watermelon growing from its seeds and we are also going to sow seeds for growing the watermelon now for the coco peat grow bed it is very simple to put the seeds directly into the coco peat grow bed but for other two system we cannot start seed directly into those system for that we need to start the seed either into coco peat grow bed or into the uh, pro tray filled with the coco peat once the plant is established then we can shift them to the required area here what we are going to do we are going to plant watermelon into all this grow bed as well as put some of the extra plant to later on transfer to those system i will update you how to transfer that and what care after that we need to take on those system into the near future with a separate video but today i will demonstrate you how to plant watermelon into this grow bed what are the distance we are going to maintain and the thought behind it friends here is our grow bed which is 1 and 1/2 feet wide and 30 feet long here ideally we can show the two line of the watermelon but we are not going to put two lines of the watermelon instead of that we are going to put one line of watermelon and other line of the cantaloupe or the marshmallow so for that what we are going to do watermelon going to put in one line and grow it on the ground and cantaloupe or the marshmallow we are going to into put it in the another line and we are going to grow it vertically up so to maintain the good distance and allow the plant to take good sunlight and good nutrition we are going to plant it little wider distance we can plant ideally the watermelon at 1 and 1/2 feet for growing it with the grow bed so we can put one plant each every 1 and 1/2 feet and grow it within this space now for sowing it is very simple to sow the watermelon seed watermelon seeds are big in size so we simply need to take this seeds you can see the seeds are treated so we need not to do anything into it now you can see that before sowing we have moistened this coco peat grow bed well so that we need not to give any water until the plant sprouts now we are starting from here so the first hole we are making it over here we need to dig a hole around 1 inch depth so it is around this much so we are digging this hole around this size then taking one seed putting this seed one inch deep and cover with this moist coco peat this completes our sowing of this seeds now the second melon we need to put it at 1 and 1/2 feet so this is 3 inch net so 1 2 3 4 5 6 here we are going to put second hole again hole is 1 inch deep we are putting this seed and cover it with this moist coco peat so here we are maintaining distance 1 and 1/2 feet between this uh, seed in the last we will put another 8 to 10 seeds for later on transplanting into the our media bucket or the dwc bucket and i will update you when i transplant it and what type of care we should take at the transplanting i will explain you in that video in the near future but right now we are just going to complete our sowing this way all the watermelon seed into this tray now once we complete the sowing then we are not doing anything until the seed sprouts and establish we have given even enough moisture for initial sprouting and establishment of plant once the plant reaches to to two quartilion and the first true leaf starts we can give start giving little water to it once the third leaf is started 
or grow fully we will start with the mild nutrition formula and once it is above four leaf then we will start with the regular formula i will update you on the nutrition management once we are reaching to that stage but first we need to complete our sowing and waiting for the plant to sprout and establish friend if you are also interested in growing the watermelon this season into your hydroponic system then you must make your preparation right now and start sowing the seeds later on once your plant are established i will give you all the information for making it nutrition and growing good and sweet watermelon at your home so make your preparation and harvest fresh and sweet watermelon and enjoy it happy growing